Meanwhile, Taitata Veta, Kiambu and Vihiga have been ranked among counties with the low compliance levels of procurement laws in the country by the Public Procurement Regulatory Authority, as Dennis Otieno reports. The latest assessment by Public Procurement Regulatory Authority shows an increased level of awareness on procurement and tender procedures in the country. Um, I would easily say maybe they account for 85% of these, uh, another 15%. But if you look at uh, competing tender complaints, uh, some of those cross over into whistleblower because it is the people within the tendering process that know the most about it. In terms of level of compliance, out of 13 counties assessed, the report ranks Nyeri County tops at 75%, followed closely by Mandera and Kirinyaga. Taita Taveta and Kiambu have a low compliance rate at 33% and 44% respectively. Failure to publicize contract awards and submit procurement documents are two of the biggest violations noted in most counties said that some of these entities take too long uh, to respond uh, on, uh, on the issues that uh, we have raised. And if you just look at the nature of the type of complaints that are raised, some of them uh, are, are based on lack of information. Entities don't submit, say, details of, the, of who has been awarded the tender, which is a requirement under the law. Entities, for example, don't uh, uh, give feedback uh, to entities, uh, to, to uh, complainants. A good number of counties and entities are yet to follow the set procurement and tender guidelines, a move that threatens to erode the gains made in the fight against corruption. The report shows that only 132 procuring entities submitted reports to the authority for assessment. Out of these, 17 were from counties. Oh is as long as there is a gap in your procurement process, you remain vulnerable to malpractice. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.